changes the whole complexion of the game. So um, shooting 34 percent against a good team isn't going to get you a whole lot of uh, success. Aside from just scoring, you had a couple of nice assists, rebounds, some steals today. A more well-rounded game than you know just scoring points. How important is it for you to keep doing that for the team going forward? Very important. Marcus, can you explain what the difference is in your shot right now and what it was when you came back out from your dreams and you were you know, firing on all cylinders? I don't think there's a difference. Thanks, I've Marcus. I've made a couple less. Um, took good shots today. Um, missed a lot of bunnies around the rim. That was the more disappointing thing. I know I missed a couple threes, but uh, I missed some layups that we needed. Isaiah, Joel, or Joel, Justin, we all missed a couple cheap shots uh, around the rim that we really needed to, to kind of get in a groove offensively. We never could. As a, as a team, do you see any signs or indications that you guys can be a better three-point shooting team going down the stretch, or at this point in the season, is this who you guys are? No, I mean we're 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 a better shooting team than we've shown for the past couple of weeks. And, you know, I have a big, uh, I play a big role in the team's three point success, and I've been struggling uh, recently. But we're a better shooting team than we've shown for the past couple of weeks. Um, we just didn't get the ball inside as much as we would have liked today. You know? When we did start getting it inside, we just couldn't finish at a high enough clip. You know, uh, as I just, I just said it three different times, we missed a lot of easy shots around the rim that we normally make, uh, and that, that kind of hurts our offensive production. So the inability to get it inside hurt the quality of the shots you were able to get, the, or, the, or the rhythm of the shot that you were able yeah, to get? Yeah, early, early we weren't getting it inside. We were settling for a lot of jumpers. Uh, and then later in the game, we were able to get the ball inside. We just weren't finishing. You know, we're a team that finishes well. We got guys that shoot really great, great percentages around the rim. We just didn't convert those opportunities to you. What has there been any adjustment period for you as far as like you know not having the ball maybe in that in your hands as as much as you had in the past or no? I mean, there's there's definitely an adjustment. But I mean, I played I don't even know how many games now, so that's definitely not really relevant to what's going on right now. It was more of an adjustment period when I first got back. You know, of my first couple of years, I played PG and shooting guard. This year, strictly a shooting guard, but that was you know 10 or 11 games ago, so I'm completely fine. In some Marcus, you mentioned the bunnies that you missed. You yeah. hadn't been getting a lot of those in the last few games. Did you feel like you had a fuller game today because you had more of those opportunities tonight? Yeah, I mean, if your shot's not falling, you like to attack the rim. As a team, we weren't making a lot of outside shots, so uh, we all took it upon ourselves to get to get the ball to the basket. I know Joel had a couple of nice drives, couldn't quite finish. I had three or four drives right at the rim that I didn't finish, and then our bigs also had a couple that they usually do that we just didn't get to go down. So uh, it's something I, I made an effort to do, especially in the second half, and I was a little bit more successful doing that. And, uh, hopefully, I'll continue to attack the basket. In some ways, is it a good, 